Hey guys, welcome back to NextGen Blogger and in this video, I want to show you how you can put together a video and an audio spectrum in VSCC Free Video Editor. So it's actually super easy to put together a video and an audio spectrum in VSCC. So without further delay, let's get started and see how you can do this. Now, before I create my audio spectrum and add my video, I would like to create a background for my video and audio spectrum. And so to do that, I've downloaded two images from pexels.com. So let me just import those images first in the editor and then we will do the further steps. So first of all, go to add object and select image. Now I've titled my first image wallpaper. So let me just click on that and then click on open and click on OK. So this is my wallpaper image and I would like to remove these black borders which are present on the left side and on the right side of the image. And so to do that, go to this particular option called crop tools and select auto cropping. Perfect. Now let me just import my second image. So let me just go to add object once again, click on image and my second image is titled microphone. So let me just select that image and click on open and click on OK. Perfect. Now resize this microphone image to the left side of the screen like this. Perfect. Now we will create our audio spectrum. So go to add object, go to audio visualization and select spectrum. Now you need to select the video whose audio you want to represent in the audio spectrum. So I have my video present right here. So let me just select this particular video and then click on open and then click on OK. Now mark your audio spectrum on the upper half of the screen. So let me just mark my audio spectrum on the upper half of the screen like this. Perfect. So the length of my video was 1 minute 54 second 500 millisecond and that's why the length of my audio spectrum is also 1 minute 54 second 500 millisecond. So I need to increase the duration of my microphone image and my wallpaper image. So let me just increase the duration of my wallpaper image first to 1 minute 54 second 500 millisecond and then let me just increase the duration of my microphone image to 1 minute 54 second 500 millisecond perfect so right now if I just quickly play the video for you you will see gradient peaks right now on the screen because gradient peaks is selected in the type option. So we will change this. So first of all, look inside the audio spectrum object settings, which is present inside the properties window. So right here, inside the type option, as you can see, currently gradient peaks is selected. So click on this drop down list and select gradiented lines. Perfect. Now change the start color to white and change the middle color as well to white. Perfect. Now inside the line width option, currently the value is 2. So increase the value from 2 to 10 inside the line width option. Perfect. Now inside the number of bands, currently 32 is there. So change this from 32 to 64. Perfect. 
and inside the acceleration mode option currently max threshold is selected so click on this drop down list and select stored energy perfect and so now if i just quickly play the video for you as you can see my speech waveform is clearly visible on screen perfect and finally what we will do is we will add our video so this is the same video whose audio is right now represented inside the audio spectrum in the form of this wave so place the cursor at the beginning like this and go to add object select video and select the video which you had selected earlier for your audio spectrum so let me just select this particular video and then click on open and then click on ok perfect and now let me just resize my video like this and place it properly right here perfect and let me just place it properly on this particular portion of the screen and let me just click on this option which is vertical align center perfect and so now if i just quickly play this entire thing for you from the beginning like with john scully um John came from PepsiCo, and they, they at most would change their product, you know, once every 10 years. I mean, to them, a new product was like a new size bottle, right? So if you were a... So this is how you can combine a video and audio spectrum in VSDC. Now we can do further couple of things. So like I can add a fade in effect to all these four objects. So let me just double click on the wallpaper image and go to video effects go to transparency select fade in and then click on ok go back to the main editing timeline now double click on the microphone image and go to video effects go to transparency select fade in and then click on ok now double click on the audio spectrum go to video effects Go to transparency, select fade in and then click on OK. And finally, double click on the video and go to video effects, go to transparency, select fade in and then click on OK. Perfect. And so now if I just quickly play this video for you once again from the beginning. Like with John Scully, um, John came from PepsiCo, and they they at most would change their product, you know, once every ten years. Or they were the ones that got promoted, and therefore they were the ones that ran the company. Well, for PepsiCo that might have been okay. So as you can see, guys, this is how you can combine or put together a video and an audio spectrum in VSTC Free Video Editor. Do let me know your thoughts in the coming section below. Like the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I will again see you in the next video. Till then, thanks for watching.